So in this video, I'm gonna show you five trending products that are perfect to start selling today. You guys seem to enjoy my previous video on the top five niches today. So I thought I'd take it one step further and actually show you five specific products. And as always, I will be going into the different profit breakdowns of each product, as well as the Facebook ad targeting options. And with that being said, thanks for tuning in. I hope you enjoy it. And let's jump straight into product number one. Just a quick note before we jump into product number one, this PDF is downloadable for free. If you wanna get your own copy, which contains all the links to different products and data etc um, like I said it is 100% free just simply head down into the video description below and it will be the first link there so with that being said let's jump straight into product number one which is this solar powered LED owl garden light now bear with me on this one it may not look like a lot looking at the product itself however all the product decisions I've made in this video I want to back up with real data that I'm going to show you so why is this such a good product people are spending money and time in their gardens for a couple of reasons really the main one obviously being due to the virus due to the lockdown down people are forced to stay at home with the weather being nice as well people are naturally spending more time in their gardens but even when the lockdown ends because we are coming into that particular season into barbecue season then people will still continue to spend time in their gardens and therefore the demand for products like this will continue just to kind of back this up then i have links to the google trend info here which i want to show you um, and when this loads up finally we can see this is for specific garden lights and we can see the interest has peaked or it's going to continue to peak i think it will continue to increase as we come into season because what we can also see is that typically we would only see this demand around kind of october time which is kind of like as we come into winter but due to the current circumstances we've seen an unnatural peak and spike in popularity this time of year so as i record this video these specific products so garden lights are super in demand the next point which is really important is the fact that products like this combines two particular interests on facebook when a product combines more interests than one then that product becomes more relevant and more specific to your audience and the more specific you can be on facebook the greater success you're going to have so essentially we're not just targeting people who have an interest in their garden but we're also targeting people who have an interest in their owl in owls so when they essentially they see this light they feel like this product has been specifically made for them they can't resist it and they have to impulse buy it there and then which leads me on to the next point then is there's great profit margins and upsell potential with the products like this and it falls nicely into that impulse buy bracket so the price per unit is seven pounds 88 this is for this particular supplier so if you click this link and open it it will take you to this specific supplier who's selling it for seven pounds 88 a few people mentioned in the previous videos i've done that they couldn't find the item on aliexpress so i've decided to actually include the link within this presentation retail wise you could easily get away with 15 pounds per unit or say an upsell of 24.99 for two this is the sort of thing where people might buy say two three four or even half a dozen of these things depending on how big their garden is profit per sale then if you do manage to upsell them and sell them two hours as you can see there's two different styles so the chances are they are going to buy the pair to have the matching set that leaves you a 17 pounds 11 profit per sale and that doesn't include anything else you upsell anything else you cross sell or if you manage to bring them back onto your site and sell them something else when you take the retail price and divide the profit per sale that gives you a break-even ROAS of 1.46 so when you're looking over your ad sets as an overview point and you have the ROAS down the right hand side or wherever you choose to lay it out and then as long as that ad set is performing above 1.46 and essentially as long as you've done your maths correctly you're going to be making a profit in terms of Facebook interests what I would recommend is targeting females they tend to be the gender that focus more on their gardens 40 plus and then the specific interests of owls gardening garden design gardening tips birds and bird watching so all of these are in fact interests that you can target on facebook well, with that being said let's move swiftly on to product number two product number two is a fast defrost plate this is actually a product that i myself have quite a keen interest in um, the reason being is because i freeze a lot of meat and something like this one of the biggest pains of freezing meat is when it comes to defrosting it it can take hours unless you put it in the microwave and then even then when you take it out the microwave it doesn't quite do it right it doesn't quite taste the same if that makes sense if you've ever done it yourself you know what I'm talking about but there's a couple of other reasons as well so people are spending money and time in their gardens and stockpiling food I mentioned previously for the previous products that were coming into barbecue season where people get that frozen meat out of their freezer and instead of having to wait hours on end for it to to defrost they can use something like this which does it in about 20 to 30 minutes and the second point is obviously with people being on lockdown more and more people are doing barbecues I myself are one of those people in fact I tried to buy a barbecue on Amazon last week and they're all sold out because everybody's just buying them up at the moment. If we have a look at the Google Trend Info as well, I always like to back up these product decisions with the data. We can see that the barbecue search term 
is once it finally loads the most popular it ever has been since 2004 so in 16 years of time so there's definitely a demand for barbecuing and those type of products which go with that particular niche next i want to show you a particular facebook ad example for this product so again if you do download this pdf you will get these links that you can go to um, and use these yourself for your own research um, it's just a really nice video it had some really good feedback really good engagement so it's obviously doing well performing well and it's obviously products that people want to buy so if you do go ahead and sell products like this yourself then i would definitely use this video um, as inspiration for your own ad my favorite part of the video is coming up now where they have an ice cube on this tray versus on a plate just to kind of illustrate how fast or how much quicker it is to defrost something on this plate it's just a great marketing tool it's a great way of showing how effective a product like this actually is and the true benefits behind actually buying it in terms of numbers then it's going to set you back seven pounds sixty per unit and retail rise i had a look around at a few different stores selling this product and 20 pounds seems about average so it falls nicely into that kind of um, impulse buy bracket which leaves you as a profit per sale of 12 pounds 39 that's if you don't sell them two at a time three at a time or some other product as an upsell opportunity do the maths and it leaves us with a break-even rise of 1.61 typically when it comes to a break-even rise i like to try and find products that are under two and then that way when you spend 10 pound on facebook ads you should be looking to make about 20 pounds back facebook interest wise then here's just a few but again there's tons and tons of different ones you guys can experiment and test with i'll definitely go for both genders purely because it's the sort of thing you could buy as a gift for your partner um, so both are going both parties going to be interested i would go for 20 plus as well because barbecues attract people of all genders and all ages and in terms of specific interests in which you can target this would be my starting point so you can actually target barbecues meat steak chicken the kind of meats that you would expect people to freeze um, barbecue grill grilling and frozen food moving on to product number three which is the pilates home workout bar this one kind of speaks for itself but the main opportunities and all the main benefits or reasons of why this features on this list is because the homework workout niche is probably the biggest thing right now in terms of different industries and niches that have had an increase in spike due to the virus and home workout niche is probably the biggest for two reasons really number one gyms are closed so people are forced to work out at home and then number two there's more people working out because the number one excuse of why people don't go to the gym is because they don't have the time but because now they're forced to stay at home they have that extra time so there's more and more people experimenting and getting involved with fitness if we just take a look at the google trend information this backs it up we can see the spike and increase in popularity for this um, specific product alone so this is for the actual pilates bar search term we can see it is crazy crazy popular there's no denying it when you look at this graph you can see that for pilates bars people are looking to buy this specific product so why not give it to them and advertise it on facebook if we go back to keynote then if we have a look at this sell the trend info i'm not sure if this guy will work for you unless you have sell the trend but i think i've got the tab open here i have here so just to kind of illustrate again another way of kind of finding the data behind a specific product to see if it is in demand we can see the amount of orders has just increased and increased ever since the beginning of the year one other very interesting piece of information on this page is the stores that these guys are currently tracking for this particular product not a single if we have a look on the right side so they're selling on 20 stores there's not a single store selling this in the uk or a uk based store so what this tells me is there's a huge opportunity to be had that's what a lot of people don't realize is they see certain products in videos and think everybody's talking about them they're so saturated nobody can sell these successfully but the world is a big place and there's more than one country too most people go straight to the us when in fact i've found there be to be better opportunities to be honest in other countries profit margins for this particular product are really awesome plus there's just tons and tons of different upsell and cross-sell opportunities you can have obviously there's different resistance bars there's ab rollers there's yoga mats you can offer some kind of bundle and get people to spend end up spending like 50 60 pounds with you but if you were to just to sell this one particular item on its own price per unit is 10 pounds 54 you could retail this for 29.99 quite easily i've seen people selling it for nearly double this believe it or not which leaves you with a profit per sale if you do sell it for 30 pounds at 19 pounds 45 which is pretty respectable that gives us a break-even rise of 1.54 and obviously if you can upsell some other products with that it's going to bring that down even further facebook interest wise then again just some starting points for you guys i'll definitely go for females i think it's going to be majority females using a particular product like this because it's more kind of based around leg workouts and most men that i know for example don't like to train their legs i would go for 18 plus i would go for interest so again these are specific interests you can target on facebook squats strength training workout bodybuilding fitness again there's just 
tons and tons of different interests and avenues you could go down with a product like this. Product number four is solar powered LED poor garden lights, similar to product number one. However, this is a different audience and an even more passionate audience. I think this product can be even more successful. I showed these to my girlfriend and she wanted me to buy them straight away because we have dogs and we are dog lovers. It's just the perfect product for the perfect time of year. As it says here, people are spending more money and time in their gardens due to lockdown and due to the fact that the weather is improving proven and we're coming into barbecue season. I won't show you guys the Google Trend Info because it's the same link which I showed you for the owl lights. It's the same thing. People are searching for garden lights. Garden lights are really popular this time of year and the same principles apply for the combined two interests. So not only are we finding people who are passionate about gardening but finding people who have dogs, people who are passionate about dogs. In terms of the profit margins, again they're really good for a product like this. It's the sort of thing that people might buy two, three, four of these things. Plus being a dog owner myself, I know other people. I have friends and family who are dog owners. So it's this sort of product that you might even end up buying a gift to someone, which leads to loads of opportunities. So the price per unit is 10 pounds, 11 pence, retail at 30 pounds, easy for a product like this, or you could sell two perhaps for 40 pounds. If somebody has like a patio, um, path that kind of leads down their garden they might buy two or three of these things to kind of make it stretch the entire row if somebody only commits to buying one of these then it still leaves you with a profit per sale of 19 pounds 88 which is a break-even rise of 1.51 which is quite middle of the road quite achievable and again that doesn't include any potential upsell or cross-sell opportunities that you include with this particular product in terms of facebook interests um, i was selling the dog niche myself so i know a few good ones i want to share with you um, it's definitely the female audience which tend to be the biggest buyers it tends to be people over the ages of 40 plus and in terms of the actual interests themselves then you could go down the dog road or the cat road but if you were to stick to dogs i would go for gardening garden design gardening tips dog training and dog walking just make sure the interests that you pick are solely relatable and responsible and relative to people who actually own dogs or own cats. Product number five then is actually one of the most in demand and popular products right now and that is the UV nail lamp. For a couple of reasons really, obviously people are having to do their nails at home due to the lockdown, salons are shut and people are bored at home so what do they end up doing? They end up doing their nails. It was actually my girlfriend which gave me the idea of doing this and ever since lockdown she's probably done her nails probably four or five times so that kind of speaks for itself. In terms of the actual Google Trend info as well, I'll show you this because it is quite surprising for this specific search term. So this is UV nail lamp in the UK since 2004. It is the most popular it has ever been. So again, as I record this video, there is a strong, a very strong demand for this exact product right now. This is also backed up by the seller trend information. We can see there's a strong increase in demand and popularity for this specific product. And even though they're only tracking six different stores, not a single one of them is based in the UK again. So just consider that next time you're thinking of audiences to target, perhaps separate them up and look at kind of like the data between different countries. And you might be pleasantly surprised that places like the UK or other European countries are actually much cheaper in comparison to the US. In terms of the numbers then, there is huge, huge, huge opportunity to be had with a product like this, because if somebody's buying the lamp, they need the varnish, they need the gels, they need the acrylics. Yes, I know all the terms um, that go along with this. So there's so much you can upsell and cross sell with a particular product like this. So the price per unit to just buy the lamp itself, if you go for a decent one, um, is £11.37. You could retail this for easy £24.99. What I would suggest is to go cheap on the actual price of the lamp, but then have so many different cross selling opportunities that that's actually where you make the bulk of your profit. Even though if you only sell the lamp itself, you're looking at 1362 profit per sale, which gives you a break even ROAS of one pounds 83 pence. Audience wise then on Facebook, I would stick to females and 18 plus. And in terms of the actual interests themselves, again, you can target these specific terms and interests on Facebook. Nail art, nail polish, nail salon, perfect nail, self care, manicure, pedicure. Again, the list just goes on and on and on. A great tool to kind of find interest is Audience Insights. I've done videos on that in the past. So if you do want to learn how to find interest, then make sure you go back um, and check that particular video out. And with that being said then guys, just to wrap the video up very quickly, I want to say thank you very much for watching. Don't forget to comment, like, and subscribe. I do read every single comment. So if there's a question you want to ask me, make sure you post it down below and I will get back to you. 
Um, I've got some new free ebooks too that I've put together over the course of the last couple of weeks. So if you want to check those out, they're on different aspects of your business. Head to the links in the video description below. And then finally, if you do want a full mentorship program that comes with my full support and guidance, make sure you check out the Ecom Academy. There will be a link in the video description below. So feel free to head over there, check it out, see the kind of information, um, support networks, resources and content and testimonials. Um, and of course, any questions, just make sure you let me know. With that being said, thanks again for watching. I hope you enjoyed it and I'll see you in the next one.